guys, Pauline here um, with my magazine. Um, I'm going to do some picture harvesting. This was the third video choice in my Facebook group, uh, Blue Book Banter, and I'll leave the link for it down below. So this is Prima, and it's one of my favourite non sort of specialist magazines you know so not i would say daphne starry and breathe flow things like that are sort of specialist these are just normal woman, women's magazines you get in the news agents um and prima is one of the one of my more favorite ones to use so whenever i'm going through if there's something I like I'll just rip the page out Um, didn't do that at the start actually but now I do and I see uh, it just seems easier Um, so I love florals of any description pretty much and then I just roughly cut them out and always Sort of check on the back and see what's on there too. So there's a vintage picture here, which is quite pretty. So cut it out. And want that little doggy. Just really cute. And then the other things that I like to look for are some words. So that's better in purple. I'm going to cut it out. And I'll probably just take that times with it as well. And then cut them apart later. Um, and then June 2020 might come in handy. This is why I like Prima. There's so many images that you can get and then you have to sort of decide which ones you're going to take. Um, really like uh, scenery, pretty places. So I'm going to take it. And whatever I take, I mean, someone else will take different stuff. I'm going to take this lady because there's very few ladies with grey hair, which I have. I don't dye my hair anymore. Um, and I usually take any cups or teapots that I find. So I'm just going to roughly cut that out. I like that we garden scene as well. I quite like the lady with the cookies for her eyes. And there's not much on the other side. Um, yeah, so sometimes um, me and my daughter, Megan, will, oh, someone's at the door, dogs will not uh, share magazine. So she'll go through one first. And then um, hand it over to me. And the things that she picked out of it not the things that I would have picked out of it. Um, so I'm going to take this cup oh, no it's not a cup it's a jug. Just cut the jug bit off. Um, and then this is quite cool. This we can of something or other. I'm going to take it and then that there is really cute but I've sort of cut it a wee bit. Um, I'm going to take that kindness. The other thing is, 
depending on what size your glue book is um, also will dictate what you're going to take out of um, the magazine so but if there's something I sort of like I'll just take it anyway and if I don't use it I don't use it Probably just let um, this video run probably for just over 10 minutes or so. Um, I do watch other people harvest magazines as well, but sometimes it can be um, run for quite a long time, which I don't mind, but. I know other people aren't going to want to sit and listen to someone for that length of time. There's some really pretty clothes in this. Lots of fashion. But then there's other bits and bobs as well. Just looking through, I'll go through this again um, before I give it to Megan off camera and take out all of like maybe the tinier wee bits and bobs. Do sort of look for vintage images because they're good in junk journals. Um, hello harder to find vintage images and magazines I find um, obviously normal images but take them whenever I find them that bird's beautiful let's take this out it's on the back So animals, florals, and um, those cupcakes are really cute. Take those. And then you also have started to see um, stuff about lockdown and isolation and things as well creeping into the magazines. take these shoes because um, an online friend Elizabeth over at um, Never Hopeless Elizabeth she goes for walks and then she puts Zoe's shoe in her journal when she does it so I said I would collect those for her and then I'll go back and get that doggy later because we've already got the wee tiny picture of the doggy this is beautiful Another vintage picture. And then we've got more fashion. Um, more ladies with grey hair. I love, um, sometimes you can get these without the writing, which are good. So a bowl of fruit I'll probably go back and get. That's a really pretty bag. So if so, something like that, I would probably take the full page. Um, because you can use the rest as background, but then if these are really really cute as well, 
and that lamp. So much in this magazine. It really, really is. Um trying to think how much it was. Uh, three ninety nine, although this one was in a pack with another book. Um So for three ninety nine, there really is a lot in this one. Some magazines you can go through and get a handful of pictures. This one I will be going back through. This is fine tooth comb. Um, at weekends I'll go back and cut that out. That door there with the wallpaper behind it is really nice. I tend to cut out rooms that I like as well, that I like the look of. Okay, and then florals and butterflies. So, here we are just over 11 minutes. So, hope this gives you some ideas about what to look for. Um, letters are quite good to look for, unusual ones, vintage, some words some pretty pictures, um, some bigger words, florals, little bits of cutlery and things that you like, models, scenery, um, animals, and I think, oh yes, and rooms that you like. So hope this gives you some ideas about some of the images to look for. If you enjoyed this video I'd really appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up. To consider subscribing that would be even better. I'll leave the link to the Facebook group down in the comments and I'll see you next time. Bye!